So EA have released the next academy star. It's going to be Jacob Ramsey from Aston Villa. And we need to score four goals using English players and live foot friendly youth excellence. And we'll go through all of this once it's out. Then we have assist four goals using the 82, which you get from this. You also get yourself a token as well or a pack by the looks of it. Play seven matches in live foot friendly with an overall 82, which is again the first card you get. Once you've done that four times or seven times, you unlock the 84 rated. Oh, okay. It's four, a finesse shot four times with the 84 in your starting squad. Then what a finesse shot is, is RB or R1 while you're shooting. Then play 10 matches in this youth excellence with the 84 in your team. You unlock the 86. With the 86, you need to score eight goals using English midfielders and having the 86 Ramsey in your starting squad. At least one goal per match and four separate wins with the 86 in or using the 86 you got to score one goal or assist one goal sorry with the 86 in your team then we have play 12 matches with him in your squad and then play 20 matches why is that it's where that's silly 12 and 20 so play 20 matches and you'll lock the full card looking at the card quickly he can three star four star high medium can play right mid cdm cam and center mid Looks like an okay card, to be honest. No decent flair, uh, tra uh, traits even. And then we'll have a look now what we need out of this. So we have got ourselves the youth excellence. So lone players one, countries minimum three, England one and you're 11. So first thing we're going to do is go to our team. And we are going to add an English player. If you've not got Gordon, for example, add any other English player. It can even be an icon if you need it to be. So what I'm going to do here is go and get myself an English player. And let's see who we have in our squad. And then we'll talk about team and tactics. You can use icons or team of the years if you have them. Whatever loan you have, you can have one loan in. So there we go. We've ticked that box. And now our team is ready to go. For the start off, we really need to get assist. But I'm going to show you some tactics here that are going to help you underway. So first of all, you want to press left trigger or L2. Go to four, triple two. You want to have balanced, 45, 70. Balanced, direct passing, 50. Five players in the box, two on corners, two on free kicks. If you find yourself being countered attack on corners and free kicks, knock this down to one each and you should be able to fix that problem. But let me know if you have struggles with that. In terms of formation, it is the 4 triple 2 as mentioned. You want to have your two most attacking players up front, your secondary of hacking players as your left and right cam, your two defensive midfielders or midfielders in general who are going to be box to box in the midfield and then your back four. And in terms of instructions, we have got balance, getting behind, balance, balance, or default, default, default. The exact same, default balance, getting behind, balance, balance. Then our right cam is to come back on defense, get into the box for crosses, default, default. The same for our left one is going to be come back on defense, get in the box, default, default. Now CDM is going to be cut passing lane, come back while attacking and cover center. Make sure they are on that, otherwise it won't work. The same for cut passing lanes, cover center, stay back while attacking. Then we have stay back while attacking, overlap, and the exact same. And I'm explaining why how and how this formation works. We'll have a word from today's sponsor first. Are you tired of playing sweat teams like this? Make sure you go to Alt 9, select foot, select foot 23 coins, choose which console and how many coins you'd like to buy, select your payment method, and don't forget to add code NANIC for 6% off on all orders. So how this formation works is if your keeper collects the ball from a corner or a short or a goal kick, you want to play it to your left back or your right back, depending on which side of the screen you prefer to play. So let's use the right back, for example. You then have a triangle here between the Jarzinho and the Bellingham as a triangle. These three players here are going to be your triangle. So why this is really good to have stay back while attacking and overlap is because the AI will notice if there's space in front. If there's space in front, he'll move forward. If he notices there isn't any space, he'll drop back and you'll never be caught out. But what I like to do is go from the goalkeeper to the right back. Then we can either play it forward to Jarzinho or play it to Bellingham. Let's say you play it to Jarzinho. You can then pass it to Drew Bellingham. And this opens up the next triangle of attack. Who can then play it towards your striker. Who's always going to be sitting on the halfway line. Waiting to attack. Because when you don't have the ball. This formation drops into a 4-4-2. So Jarzinho and Ribery will both drop back in line with Cruz. Ready to defend, you're in a 4-4-2 with your two strikers just sitting at the top waiting to attack. And you have this triangle here with Jarzinho, Mbappe and Bellingham. And the same with Zambrotta, Jarzinho and Bellingham. They're the two triangles you have. And it's the exact same on the other side. You can do the exact same thing. Once you learn to incorporate these triangles, you can then go from Cruz to Jarzinho over to Ribery. And your opponent's not going to be able to keep up with the passing. And it's going to give you so many options in attack. I'm not sure if it's going to be crazy sweaty or not. Hopefully it's golden goal because it is no limited games. And it should be nice and easy. If you have any questions or you're struggling, comment down below. If you're new to the channel, hit that like button, subscribe. Catch you in the next one. See you.